Stranded Deep, a gem of a game filled with vast open waters where sharks are lurking about, hunting, gathering, and looking for food, all the while trying to stay afloat, let alone alive. This game had me scared to my core a handful of times with how dark it would get underwater, the rhino sharks that were faster than the Flash himself, and bosses that could fly out of open waters and directly at you. Personally, it didn't make a lick of a sense, but I think that was its charm. It didn't have to. That said, today I spent 100 days in Stranded Deep, which took me far and wide on my journeys, leading to underwater shipwrecks and islands filled with loot galore. That and just straight up anacondas or snakes that wanted me for dead. BT Dubs, if you do enjoy this type of video, leave a like down below, hit that subscribe button, and let me know what game you'd want to see me record next. So without further ado, I spent 100 days in Stranded Deep, and here's what happened. In a world where there's one man ready to survive, the Stranded Deep. It's me, it's Ray Pandas. How you doing guys? What's going on? Hope you're doing well. I'm playing Stranded Deep. I'm doing 100 days. We're gonna see how fun it is. It's gonna be pretty fun because I, I added a few maps, okay? Don't hate me, I added a few maps just to kind of spruce it up. With my very first day in, I was on another plane just like in the forest and hit some turbulence. Can I move? I can move now. Okay. That beginning, that intro, that was that was close to the forest, man. All we need is a Timmy. Anybody found a Timmy? Have you guys seen a Timmy? Timmy! Timmy! Oh. Did I break the game? Day one. We got islands, beautiful sharks. We got the raft type. This is my raft and where's the... Oh, there we go. With a paddle to my name and some extras in the storage, all I could do was set sail for land, and lucky enough, there was a small island in our sights. That looks a little big, right? I feel like we should go there. Sorry, island. Love you, but I'm going to the operate. Oh, uh, I gotta turn around. Gotta turn around. We're going to this island. Are you kidding me? Holy crap, look at that. That is insane. I'm checking this map out. We're just, we're going, map, island. I'm going to this island. There's only one map. What am I, <laughs> I'm losing my mind already. Oh, I've been lost at sea for so long, guys. It's day 42, and I've only eaten my toenails and nail clippings of the toenails. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Free the willy. What was that? Did you see that? That was like a massive tail. Are there whales in this game? I mean, to be honest, I only know or have seen sharks. Turns out as I got closer to the island, it wasn't that small, nor was I alone. If I see anything terrifying, I, I'm gonna just leave. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave, you know? Do, do. I love the music though. Oh my God. Is there anything inside? Oh, hello. Nope. Ow, what the f- Did you just clip me? D I just found a pickaxe? No. 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 Yes, I got it. How's my HP looking? Wonderful. This next part, you may want to look away as I wanted to test how deep in the waters I could go. This is so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna swim down. And this is really dumb. And... I already don't like it, and I'm regretting it, and why am I doing this? Hello? Oh my god. I just want to see what happens, you know? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, my stomach is turning. This go around, I finally figured it out. Don't be dumb. Or curious. Well, maybe just a little curious. Pulling my raft to the shore, I had yet another hundred days to explore, survive, and even escape if that was possible. Things started off much better than my first attempts. What I needed to do now was build my first shelter. Everything in hand, it was as easy as one, two, three. Ta-da! Right there. What are, what's happening? What's happening? What's ha oh my god, we're burning! Burning up, dude. Burning up. Moments later, I started to notice my skin and how red it was becoming. Aloe. Did it work? Oh, aloe gives you full max thingy. Holy crap, that's beautiful. Oh, that is a beautiful, gorgeous thing. I love that. Holy, 
that is amazing. And I also found more loot sitting around in this odd looking chest I soon brought to the shore. Actually, no, we found cloth over here, right? There was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I think it was, was it in here? I don't know. We'll find something. They usually have a few hidden sequets of sorts. Ooh, that's good. I'll take that with me. I could use the storage anyway, so. Come here. All right, what's in? Yay, perfect. Holy crap. Ooh, dang. That's actually really good. With a bit more loot to pick up around the island, this last thing would haunt me for days and many weeks to come. The potato that I thought nothing much of was the only fuel source I would then need for a build later in game. Crafts, and then let's get the coconut, coconut, doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo, coconut. With the next day upon us, I made sure to fill up on water and food that we had lying around. So we have to drink the water from here. Yummy! Sweet, we did it. And then it's just gonna fill up. With my new axe crafted as well and ready to start the next task, it was clear on what I needed to do. Craft a hammer and some wood foundations. So with some trees chopped down and cut into branches and palms cut into single pieces, the beginning of my building started to come along nicely. Woo, we did it guys, we did it. And I'm scared, <laughs> cause of the storm. The next best thing to do was just build a little hut, piece by piece, tree trunk by tree trunk placing all the walls up to give me some stability and then giving roofing standing tall. In the moment, I thought it looked good as I peered out into the bright blue sky. Cleaning up a few things around the shelter, I wanted more sticks and some coconuts. Those bad boys would give me both water and some nice food. With that out of the way, I was really struggling on this small looking crab. With a nice little shipwreck nearby, we climbed aboard and started looking through some of the scraps, this storm picking up in the background. Oh wait, I think we can climb up here. We use these, right? We hold space. Oh, you can! Sweet! Hello. I will take this. What else do we have? A storm's a brewing. It's a coming. Hope you're ready, y'all. Wait. <gasps> Binoculars! Woo! Jerry can. Oh, jeez. Whoa, a storm's really coming. A storm is really coming. By the end of the storm that was brewing, here's the kicker. My base was about to be finished just in time for the rain then to go bye-bye. Oh, I like this. I like having like an ice open area. That's cool. Okay, you know what? I'll keep it. With another wreck close by and a shark waiting to eat me like a snack, there was no better time than now to test my luck. There was, there was another boat here with a shark, but I gotta be careful. Cause that shark be real mad. Um, wow, there really isn't anything here. Okay. All right, let's go back up. Oh, man. Woo! That's a shark. Okay, that's a shark. Took the rest of the night to build up a few more half walls and then call it a night there. With the flashlight in hand, it was guiding me along as we looked about, testing the range on this thing. Wait, wait, wait. I was supposed to craft that crude spear. Hold on. That's right. Um... Ooh, can I kill this thing? Hold on. No, I guess not. That's fine. While the sun started rising, next on my to-do list was fishing for some sardines. I will say it's still early in the game, but the toughest part for me was keeping my food and water high. By now though, it was time. Only way to get more resources or just stuff was going from island to island. So in part, we picked up the raft and made ways to a much bigger and scary island across the waters. Really dumb, but hey, we're doing it. The battle, the day, beauty, beauty. Yeah, I'm going to that big old island there. Look at that thing, man. That thing's huge. This place was massive, and I truly didn't know where to start. Alrighty. Come on. Come on. Come up a little more. Alrighty. Just gotta watch out for those big crabs, actually. I forgot those might be here. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> no. But also, these guys. I need more of these. The biggest thing I could start with was more fiber because we would need lashing for days to come. I heard a snake nearby and just ran away. Getting some wood chopped up for another shelter because something I started doing was in fact building shelters on every single island. It was still pretty early with the sun not out as I got another level to my name. Hopping around from fibrous leaves to another and gathering what I could. Something that scared me and caught me off guard was the amount of sharks this place had surrounding it. <gasps> 
look at all the sharks here. Yo, that's a lot of them. Why? Surprisingly, rocks are tough to come by, especially if you don't have a pickaxe. They don't respond as frequently as everything else. What the f- What is that? Look at these! Is that normal? Uh, ooh. Yo, look how big that shark is! Oh my god! Unsure of what to do, or at least where to go next, I picked up my raft and decided on leaving the place, slowly paddling my way back to base with the waves crashing back and forth. We emptied out our inventory into storage, trying to figure out the best route in building my first raft. I mean, at this point, it's just we gotta start building a raft to get to places faster and easier and better. To build a raft, we need this one. 14 sticks, holy crap. It is now time. I really just want to build the, the raft. I got to build a raft, man. I got to build a raft. Got to build the raft. While the moon was out, helping shed some light on the matter, I continued with chopping down more trees for my soon-to-be raft, placing the parts we gathered down into the water. We would still need a lot more wood for days to come, and with that in mind, I eventually made my way back to Big Shark Island. It was the only place I really knew, and that had a lot more trees. All right, come with me. Ow, 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 ow. What did I, what, what? Okay, hold on, hold on. Woo, there's so many sharks out for blood. Like, I, okay, good for you guys. You guys did it. This is definitely going a lot quicker, for sure. Funny enough, the biggest problem I had was the raft itself. What? Oh, it's because we're full. Well, I'm sorry, La oh my god, I capsized us. Okay, not good, not good, not good. Come back here. Probably shouldn't have done that with a log. Oh my god. Hold on, I gotta I gotta flip us somehow. How do you flip this? Can can you can you fix can you fix? Can you fix? Other way. Other way. Go that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. I don't even know what's happening. Woo! All right. Yeah, you can leave me. I'm kidding. Please don't leave me. It'll be a lot easier once I get the raft going, though. That's going to help so much. Though with all that said and done, it still wasn't even close to being built. So with the sun setting and us in our raft, we quickly made haste towards the island once more. Maybe I shouldn't be doing this at night time. If the... Sorry, when the moon comes out, I should be all right. It's going to be dark from that little transition of the sun disappearing, moon reappearing. Chopping down twice as many trees while on the island and then taking what we had back to home base. Looking through and knowing that we needed a plank station to get started or rather finished, we jumped onto the raft once more, steered in the direction of the island and found something new once we arrived. Yep, there they are. Oh boy, okay. Um, hold on. Yo, that is so many sharks. Um, okay, the sea anchor is deployed, so I I hope that means we're good. I I I know this is dumb. I should probably get closer. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, okay. Ooh, sea turtle. All right, we are good to go back, and it did stay there. Wicked. With everything by my side, we got back home and built the first ever plank station. And yes, we can. Cool. We're gonna put it right over here. And now, with the three, we can do. Where is it? Wait, is it? I think it's this one of these. Okay, we. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my god. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, wait, hold on. Why is it only on that side? Oh, it's because there's the thing in the way. Mm. The last thing I didn't think of until now was the actual anchor we needed for the newly built raft. Some rocks and lashings to be precise. A new day was upon us and with the flashlight pointing our way, I finally decided on taking the new raft we had just built out for a test run. So I think we're going straight. The island in front of me, I believe, is a very small one, which is fine. That's perfect. That's what we wanted. Um, That's a cool looking island over there. The island to my left, 
I, I felt like I was seeing a boss. I really do. Like, I think there's the first boss or some sort of boss over there. Like, I was seeing a giant shark, and I think that's that's some some scary. So, oh, this is so good. <laughs> I can't see my, my watch it's for the SPF stuff, but hey, this took no time at all. This is really good. We have all the uh, inventory space we need here my, on my, my character, too. We have a flashlight, so we could stay during night times now. This is so good, so good, so good, so good, so good. It was such a new feeling having not only the raft built, but with storage aboard as well. With the chest in hand as we jumped into the water, it felt like the perfect time to start gathering away. Barrels, fiber, sticks all around. There was something else I couldn't really see, but could hear. While looking for more fibers around, we came across this small metal hut just built in the middle of nowhere. Oh, there's a little shack over there. Oh, that's so cool. Hello. Come here. Hello. Wait. Come here. Okay, we are full now. Whoa, it looks like someone used to live here. What? Whoa. Whoa. Water skin? Air tank? <gasps> A bow! Lan Ooh, lantern would come in handy, actually. Oh, and tires and logs. What the fudge? It's all laid out here? That's actually really cool. I like that. Okay. Getting stuck just before approaching our home, it was easy enough to drop the chests off, start taking out all the logs and chopping them down into sticks. I went back and forth, placing the majority we gathered down into more raft pieces. I wasn't finished there though. Making sure to grab as much as we could, I wanted this raft just finished. By now though, we definitely had the parts needed to finish up the raft, right? Finally. With the raft coming together quite nicely, and with it feeling more complete, we took a few more trips back and forth. This was the closest to calling it done. Of course, I would finish more of the builds, but that came later and with stronger parts. There's just something so ominous about it and like just... Very similar, so similar in so many ways. All right, we're here, let's do this. Now with a new island on the horizon, I would soon learn the dangers of different places they offer. <gasps> what the f- Yeah, I saw that shark there. Jumping out of the water for something. Oh my god, what the heck was that? Whew. You know what? That's actually not bad. It's like we're right here. But there's a crab right there. Where'd that guy go? Wait, do they break? <gasps> Whoa! This is not good. Health is low and I got a boar on me. Maybe we can go over here and chop some trees quickly. Somehow I managed to scare the boar off, even for a little bit. I still needed more trees for the raft, however. With the getting closer and closer, we needed a better way in defending ourselves. Uh, where did the boar go? Oh, you over there. Oh, you know what? Maybe it's breaking because- hold on, I think it's breaking because it's the shell? Oh, I killed the shell. I mean, I, I killed him. I think we gotta skin that, though. I gotta kill this boar if I want to explore anything here. Ooh, there's another boar, too. Okay, let's just have that guy run, then. Ooh, wait, I got a chest. Alright, I gotta use these spears up. Come on, now. I was planning on seeing what the plane had, but apparently if you throw too many spears really quickly, that breaks both your hands. Looks like you're dead. Ooh, look at this plane though. Isn't this plane sweet? Actually... Hello? The fudge? Why is my hand still weird? So, apparently you're not gonna give me the torch, because you're... okay. Yo, something's up with this... god damn it. Hold on, maybe if I like... I mean, we can kind of use this. All right, I got to reset this. Uh, see, that's another thing. I can't reset right now because I haven't saved. The best thing I could do at this point was jump back on my raft and head home, praying that sleeping the night away would fix the issue. Turns out all it took was a simple closing of the game and reopening. With my hands back to normal, the first thing we needed to do was put away things from the chest on the raft, spreading them out over the island. Being low on wood was still an issue and one that I planned on fixing. Parting ways now towards Shark Island, there was a welcome party for all those that came. Let's 
good. What about this one? No, we'll leave that one. Yeah, okay, let's go. Sharky poo. Oh, dang, you're fast. Ah! What? Come on, dude. I got pushed into two snakes and that one's coming for me. What the fudge? Maybe because my HP's so close to death. Oh, God. Um, hold on. How do we do this again? Uh, uh, <laughs> Antidote. I need pee pee plant and coconut flask. Oh, crap. My health is going down. I need pee pee plants. Oh, my God. Okay, we got to make sure we always have those for antidotes. With another death over my head, I packed up all I could this time, crafting up some arrows to take with us and making sure we had an antidote on hand. With the bow and arrow killing the snake where it stood, it was back to chopping down more wood, storing everything we possibly could onto the raft and then sailing our way back home. Waking up to a new day, we went around the shallows catching more sightings for the fire, this time making sure to craft up storage shelves so we could get more storage placed on the raft. If I couldn't finish building the raft right this second, you better believe I would get enough chests for the storage to come. Packing up my raft to go, the thought of revisiting the island with an angry boar was on my mind. As we arrived at the island, jumping back onto land, we went to see what else this spooky place had to offer. Wait, what? why do I have this chest on me? Uh, I'll put it here for now. Oh, that was my... Oh, I forgot to put that chest... Ah, that's fine. Hello? I hope I don't die. This place is so cool. Holy crap. I'm in like a secret warehouse area. What the fudge? What's this? I'm, I'm like scared. Like I want to talk, but I'll, uh, at the same time, I'm, I'm a little scared, you know? Like, do I talk right now? What do I do? Hello? Hello? What do we got up here, huh? Ooh, tires and all. A lot of tires, actually. Um, honestly, I'll just take that. It's like, I don't need all these engine parts. We're already getting so many. I feel like that's just a waste of space at the moment. With nighttime slowly approaching once more, I figured we could just stay here and see what else this place had. Ooh, yo, whoa, holy crap. Glad I came behind here. My goodness. The fudge? What the heck is this? It's like an underground submarine type deal. All right, we got tires. That's, oh, barrels too. Okay. What's under here? What's under here? No, no. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll take that. Ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's the open road. We don't like that. Let's get some air. By the end here, I was in fact back at home base, building something new and didn't realize I also needed something else to make that something new run. Yo, look at that. We got a moat. Oh, that's why it's not fine. Seeing that everything was just littered everywhere, I wanted to start organizing my place just in case we had guests. This one will be the food related stuff. So like aloe and that. Yeah, kindling would be by the fire. If we need sticks for this fire, we'll be there. Stone tools will be over here with food, fish, tool, sticks. Campfire's out of fuel. No, it's not. What? With the rest of the chests on my raft, I did a quick grab and go on another island, chopping down more trees for the wood and storing them away. We even put out some lamps for a source of light around the beach. Finally finishing up that spooky island, we parted ways back and went off in search for anything missing. What is that? Oh, that's a dead crab. Never mind, never mind, never mind. We gotta go grab some of those chests. Let's do it really quick. Go through the secret place again. Squeeze their buttocks through if I can. Hello? I can't, I can't squeeze through. What the heck? Now I can do it. Okay, what's in this one? Uh, and just the hammer. Oh, to do the ladder. I kept pressing it, like pressing holding it, but I didn't like hold it in. Oh, I thought I died. Uh, is there a safe way to get down? I think I broke something, yep. That definitely wasn't so fun, but we did have the materials for what was next, a splint. The last thing I planned on doing with this island was taking any barrels, tires, or buoys we saw days back and adding them to the raft. I wanted a bigger raft, though I would soon realize the bigger the raft, the harder they are to turn. With it being the end of the day here, I was having the toughest of problems trying to find my way out. Now we're kind of going off by just like 
Echo location. Oh no, it's starting to light up. Cool. Daytime's coming. Oh, thank goodness. Still out and about, there was no time like the present to then continue this adventure of ours. A new island for us to explore and with more to find with all the juicy stuff secrets it had. It looks like there's stuff underneath, which is good, but also bad. Like I'd like to go there, but... Ooh. What do we have here? Please don't be scary stuff. That's a crab. That's a snake. That's a mother flipping snake. Snake's dead. Okay, cool. Wait, whoa! You just started moving again? Hello? Um... I'm just, I'm just, I don't know what to expect. So I'm like, I'm trying to be safe, you know? Okay, that looks like we can't. All right, I think, I think we can go off of this now. Let's see. Sweet, we just gotta go straight now. Straight and then to the left a bit and we're good to go. With a few more container shelves placed and storage to go, that would end the night. Today, today was the day I almost lost my raft. I planned a great trip in my head, trying to figure out where to go as I was deeply in thought. We would see our very first whale shark. To, I wanna see what this island has first. <gasps> oh, you're really pretty and also scary. Holy crap, you're so big. <laughs> Tiger shark. With every passing minute, we were also getting closer and closer to the island that I had planned. Thing was, to get onto the actual island, I needed to physically pull my raft in some more. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. I see you, I see you, I see you. Oh, why did you stop? What? Okay, we're gonna go over here. Oh, oh, ooh, super shallow. You know what? You know, I like this. We're gonna, this is a big island. We had so much stored away on our person, I just needed to get back to home base. We'll leave this here. Oh crap, where did my raft go? Oh jeez. Uh... Why did it start moving? Why did my raft start moving? I mean, oh, okay, I really should have put the anchor down. I know that's my bad. Oh my God. I mean, I'm glad the sail is up right now because that would be moving even faster, which ain't cool. Oh, this is stupid. I shouldn't have done that. that I mean, that's my bad. I'm dumb. We're just going straight in. We're going straight in. I couldn't believe that just happened. To get my mind off of that, I stuck closer to the island, gathering its trees and chopping away for the remainder of the night. This time I made sure to grab anything else we may have needed on the island, from chests to more resources about. Wait, where did that- there was a chest out here. Did it disappear too? Holy crap. That's fast. I didn't realize it'd go like that. I was so curious what that package was for. What is this? Mystery box? Whoa. A mystery package. What? Is that a real thing? I hope so. Oh wait, no. Don't, we don't want to hold that right now. There's a crashed plane. I mean, there might not be much because it's crashed. So like a lot of it's inside stuff and things and stuff and things. Hello? Hello? Yeah, see? It's cool though. I like, you know, the feel of it. With a few more storages added the next day, the raft itself was basically done and looking really beefy. I also planned on building a smoker and to this day, I still don't know how to use the darn thing. I was gonna say, wait, how do you, oh, there we go. Aha, smoker. I don't know what it does, but it looks cool. I did build a few more stations, but at this point I really wasn't in need of them. With another beautiful looking day ahead of us, I felt the need to find more. More islands, more stuff, just more. Coming up on this next island, there was a lot of pre-made buildings that left me in an awe state. If it's the same island, you're gonna like it, but you might also hate it, but you might like it. Ooh, 20 days total. We survived 20 days, but we're on day 21. I believe that's how that works. Whoa, 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 do you see that? What is that? What? <laughs> he did that! Oh my god, I look over and there's just like a colossal of an island over there too. I mean, this thing's big, that's bigger. 
I did get lucky enough in getting some more boar hides. Raw hide was important and thankfully I had found just that. Later through the evening we did come across this secret looking cove underwater. Yo, I just saw something move. Oh, it's a bar. You think I could kill it with my with my with my stuff? I got a machete. I can't see a thing. I Okay. What type of game are we playing here, buddy boy? Where'd you go? Oh, did I win? I think I won. Having such a sight on my raft, it looked so much better than the early stages. Just felt more full and put together. That said, I did take a few pieces apart. There was some stuff I could use to build from the island itself. Grabbing the few I could, and with some lashing, it seemed to fit very nicely while putting them in place too. We did spend more time around the island, gathering what treasures awaited us from scrap laying around the place to a chest full of healing and salves. Things were looking mighty fine. We also managed to carefully climb down into a secret cave area. There's the snake. Wait, what? Hello? Woo! I got it. Hello, buddy. Where are you going? Where are you going? <gasps> oh, okay. You transformed into something smaller. I guess you were bigger. Now you're smaller. The next day in what seemed like a longer wait, we finally had a great amount of chests aboard. I built an anchor for the raft and started my way back to home base. With so much in our storages, who knew how far I'd go? Right now, the only thing I could think to do was tidying up my stuff on the beach with some planks of wood and then getting everything out for my chests on the raft and into base. With another day here, I was really curious how the clay would work, let alone look if I were to build them into platforms on my raft. All right, we're doing... Oh, wait, I shouldn't do that. I should only do the ones that have been upgraded on the bottom too. Eh, it's not a big deal. If anything, we'll just farm more. It only, it literally just takes two of these. The last thing that took place and something I truthfully forgot about was planting the potato seed. Oh, I gotta wander this thing. Ooh. Hold E to pull, yep. Will that work? I hope so. Potato plank farming plot. Take all the water. Something we had crafted and at lightning speeds was the harpoon gun and some ammunition. I was really curious how strong it was and wanted it with me just in case sharks, you know, those things in the water. Now, I don't know why, but I thought I could take just any shark with the harpoon gun. Something I didn't know at the time is it's one of the weaker weapons in the game. Hey, whoa, look at that shark. <gasps> oh! Hold on, I didn't mean to fall off. I did not mean to fall off. I swear to God, I didn't mean to fall off. Oh my God. <laughs> but while we're here. Ow, ow, ow. I can't, why can't I let go? Okay. Um. That shark was on some next level shiznick, okay? Let me tell you. This time while out, I continued to another island over and I tried looking for anything really, as we still wanted to test out that gun again. Actually, I think I could work my way down maybe. Ooh, ooh, maybe, 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 maybe. <laughs> ooh, ooh. Did I break a leg? No, we're good. We didn't break a leg. Just. HP. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's really good. Okay, cool. Looking around for more stuff, I can definitely say we broke our leg this time. Uh, it's quite annoying. But we're gonna go down this cheesy way. Ah, ah. ah crap. Now I broke something. That's okay. The only other thing to do at this island was taking barrels, tires, and all. Placing them down with lashing to then attach pieces to my raft. Going back to home base by this point, I still had a great amount of clay and blocks with no use. Until now, I finally decided to start building with clay rather than leaving it to wither away. Today would be the day I saw the first portion of the story and what my goal started to actually look like. But we're going to the ship. I haven't been to the ship yet. I uh, don't really know what to expect. All right, with this flashlight of mine, let's see you. What do we... There's really nothing here? Oh, wait. Whoa! 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 That's not nothing. This could be my way to escape the Pacific. Repair plane engine, plane propeller, cockpit, 
Stock food, water, and then fuel. Holy crap. So we go up here. We gotta fuel the plane. We gotta fix the cockpit, the engine, the propellers. We gotta fill water. It's kind of open for more. This was perfect. Things were clear in what I needed to do next and where the game would take me. I love that, okay. I really love that. Arriving at a new island, we started our search with a little hidey hole of a space. Oh no, no. Oh god. Ooh, hey. Underwater cave. Ooh. What did I just find? A special package? Cool. I fell into a secretive cave. I got a mysterious box again. Oh, look at this! A smiling hairy volleyball. Wally! Wally, Wally, Wally! <laughs> He's my best friend! I found Wally, guys! Holy crap! I didn't even know that was a thing! But I did it. I did a thing and I found a thing. Oh my god, it's a thing. I will say this must have been the luckiest find yet because of all the clay we gathered around the beaches and water. This was perfect timing. With all the new clay and chests we found, that meant we could finally start our way back home. It's also that time in the video. And if you've made it this far, comment Wally down below. With a bit more reorganizing, I couldn't believe how well everything was coming together now, and for what record timing it was. Just a quick thing here, we did break a few barrels off of our raft for a build. Looking back on it now, something I didn't like so much was the way we set our clay foundations down. There were no roof parts to give us this inverted look, so that kind of forced me back into a more simple build. Oh, it does give us things back. Okay, good. Wait, hold on. What's, uh, what's that? Uh, uh, that's fine. With everything coming together now, we could then start on some nice clay walls. Gotta build me a frame. This is where we start setting up everything. So then we're gonna build... Wait, can we build a door? Brick window. Cool. Okay, we got a brick door going. And thus is what it looks like so far. Now we need to get some roofing here. And this will just be a wall that can kind of go up and... Yeah, right? As we finished the previous night, my stomach started talking to me, and so that meant I was hungry or really needed to poop. Hold on, I'm really curious now. I want to go see if I can catch one of those other fishes. Archer fish, all right. Gotta go up to breathe. That helps. Oh! Well, that wasn't scary at all. I also did make another big mistake here. While picking up plants from the plots, you can take those same crops and replant them down. I just took the potato and shoved it into the fuel collector. Hold E to add mash. Whoa, what? <gasps> That's how you do it. Something I would make sure that also happened today was getting to that island with the big and weird looking world like tree. I don't know if that's a tree. It, it's probably something that was custom built, custom made. The first thing I did here was scouting out just to make sure nothing wanted me for a snack. That and I went around gathering as much lashing as I could. Stuff was the real in-game currency. Something else I did was gather a few barrels up and then kill more boars. <gasps> There's another boar. Small boar, that's okay. There's so many boars, whoa. Where'd they all come from, ooh, day 41. Needing some food in my belly, we went on to gathering some more boar meat, started up the fire, and began cooking the food, making sure to go underwater and find anything of use with hopefully zero encounters of sharks, all the while looking for more clay, farming up as much as I could. I did also want some more stone and found the perfect place with few deposits. We even managed to get the buoys connected to the raft. With the sun coming up, my curiosity was high and I just needed to find what was waiting for me. It's up here. Alright, let's get the spear going. Never know what lurks around the corners. Potato, potato, potato. Look at the view, holy. I mean, there's not really much to see, but it's nice, it's still pretty. Pretty cool. I'm the king of the castle. You're a dirty rascal. <laughs> I don't wanna die, please. Just before heading out, I wanted to make sure there was enough wood and leaves to go around. Better to be stocked up than not. Taking our leave once more, the night presented itself with some intimidation and I needed to find a way to sleep it off. A new day and spent on a new island, I needed to make sure I wasn't alone first. You gonna come after me now, buddy? Oh, maybe. <gasps> Is there a snake somewhere I don't see? Probably. This part is how I kept track in the game, more or less, of which way home base was, or at least the direction I would go in. Now, often back in search for my place, I tried the binoculars for the first time. Ooh, 
Oh, you know what? Wait, do we have... I might actually have binoculars now? Oh, that's the one we want to go to, because that's the one with, like, the little two-island ship thing. Today was all about getting my stuff inside my place and finishing up some clay floors I had planned. You know what? I think I'm actually going to go back to the scary island over there. I, there yeah. might be potatoes. I might get lucky. So apparently for today, I had a death wish because I wanted to see if that shark island was all talk or not. We started up the raft once more and began that journey. Once again, at the shark island, I picked up a few things and found some more stuff just laying there. Look at you see this thing? Is that normal? Is that normal? Please tell me this is normal, guys. That's not normal, right? You're seeing what I'm seeing? Uh, I mean, that's a big shark, to be honest. That's a big shark. That's, that shouldn't be in the game. That <laughs> should not be in the game. Unless that's like the Megalodon that everyone's talking about. Ow, oh, oh, where, where? Snake, right there. Great white shark. Wait, is this what we're supposed to fight? I think this is what we're supposed to fight. <laughs> like, what am I supposed to do with this? Seriously, like, how do you fight that? I mean, I guess you gotta shoot a lot, right? Shoot everything and... Oh, uh, maybe because it's on... It's, like, by this island, though, we can just shoot it that way? With nothing really happening, I figured there was no time than the present to look around for anything else I might have been missing. Oh, <gasps> Yo, we found the mother load! Wait, did I find a secret cave thing? Oh, lots of crabs. They want my booty. Oh, lots of crabs, actually. Ah, so many crabs. So many crabs. <laughs> That's my HP. I'm poisoned, hurt, and crabless. Okay. Wait. Is there something else in here? Yep. Where? I hear it, but I don't see. That's an anaconda. That's an anaconda. What do you want me to do with an anaconda? Nope. Big nope. Did I mention nope, no and uh, nope? Cool, cause no. I wanted to try it once more, killing that shark of a beast out in the ocean. I don't know why, I just, I, there's just this, you know, pulse, this thing pulling me towards it. All right, buddy, old pal of not mine. Where are you? Why is there all this stuff here, by the way? Wait, oh my God, someone spelled S-O-S. -S. I just realized, S-O-S. -S. Cool, wait, how did I not see this at nighttime? Because the lanterns would have gone off. Huh. <gasps> there it is! <laughs> Stupid! It's so dumb. All right, here we go. What if I go underwater for a quick second? See, I see you over there, but I don't see you... That is terrifying, though. Like, imagine you just see this while you're sailing, and, like, all of a sudden... I think by now I was lost at sea or just seeing things. So rather than wasting my ammo and time, I went around the island picking up as much fibrous plants I could. Back at home was a bit of the same, prepping and preparing for my fight with the first of many bosses. I wanted more and that would definitely be more than I bargained for. I picked up all the ammo I had and made sure to stock myself up with anything else we may have needed. Okay, I see the shark here, but I'm stuck on a rock. Can we not be stuck on a rock? Oh, perfect. Oh, wait, we're stuck on a rock again. All right, all right, we gotta figure this out. We got oh, I, did I save it? I don't think I saved it, it's okay. With my binoculars, I couldn't believe what I just found. There's something there. I don't know what that something is, but I want to see what it is. Well, this thing takes forever to turn. Whoa, it's eating. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What the hell? Oh, excuse my language. I'm sorry. What is that? Look at it. Oh, I'm killing him. Look at this pathetic little doo doo doo. What are you doing? Yo, you take a lot of hits. I can't see you. Oh. oh my. Oh my god, what the fudge? It's like someone threw it. Are we floating away? All right, so round two was underway and ready to go again this time. I had spears at the ready and a better mindset. Also, flying shark alert. Get off. All right, it's time to kill the Meg. Got it. Okay, it's coming. Just gotta keep an eye out. Oh God. Oh geez, Louise, we're. <laughs> oh, I don't like the music. Although it's kind of different. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 
Just kill him. Just kill him. <laughs> He's stuck. <laughs> the megalith is stuck. It's so stuck. I love it. Don't build barrels. Barrels OP because it gets stuck. Are you dead? Oh, he dead. 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 He with the collection of more wood underway, I came across this little spot filled with rock veins. What was this secret cave? Where did this new path take me? I was definitely excited. Ooh, okay. All right. We got a lot of clay to come and pick up. Holy smokes. I did not realize we had that much. I'd actually drop off a few more like things then. Curious to see what else the island had for me. I brought my bow and arrow along for the ride. Can't be too careful now. Oh, are these like tiki things? Oh. <gasps> Cool! Cool, cool, cool! Look at this! Look at this! <laughs> Woolly! Hello! Hello, Woolly! Hello, buddy! Crude axe. Can I take a, a second? That's another axe. I think that's good, right? I'm gonna leave the Wally. We don't need you, buddy. I love you, but don't need you right now. Oh, it's a little hut there, too, and a plane. Coolios. While on my way back home, I checked out some recipes we had. Uh, oh, we got this. The aircraft rudder. Wait, why is it down here? Uh, okay. I'm not fighting you again. Uh-uh. I'm gonna keep going. Bye-bye. Next thing on my to-do list was adding some more canopies to my raft. Though, truth be told, I just wanted a smaller and more compact raft. Oh, man. And we have... I, oh, yeah. So, I did a thing. I, uh, I may have put up more canopies. I mean, because why not? I figured, you know what? We don't need to have one or two. I'm going to max this out. I'm going to put canopies everywhere. With little to none planning on where I wanted to go, we took the opportunity to head over towards a big island just past the Megalodon. This island looked massive and almost Colosseum-like. First thing I was greeted by once there was another big boy crab, of course. This out, let's go. <sighs> Come here. Uh. Uh. Okay, how much did we die? Not that much. I even had this boar appear from nowhere, scaring me poopless. Oh, jeez. Just before heading inside the island to find more treasures and gems, I needed a way to tell me how to get back home. All right, so we got another arrow, this one pointing out that way to show that our base is that way. In case we get lost, we just got to find a couple of these islands, which is... It's my plan not to get lost, to the, if we get lost, to have these islands. With that finished, up the new path I went, finding a doorway to a more elaborate tunnel system. Whoa! Hello? It's a trap, I know it, but I'm doing it. Barrels, lantern for nighttime. At least they put lanterns in here. If you get stuck forever and ever, you got something to cling on to. Did we just go for it? I guess so. Whoa, what the heck? Hello? Oh, God. Just, just close that up. Okay, don't go down there. Wait, then what's in this one? Hold on. Breathing is good. I like to breathe sometimes. It's a clever way to block this. I think I'm just gonna go for it. I just need to breathe for even just a second. Okay, what's up here? I'm not a fan of snakes though, I'm gonna be honest. Underwater, no. Um, if it was just like normal snakes I came up to on a path, maybe. But I, I can't deal with the underwater stuff. Whoa! I don't have a pickaxe, so I wouldn't be able to get out of here. There's also a shark right there. I don't know why. Looks like we gotta parkour this stuff. Holy crap! I was definitely going to come back here, though we did have a full inventory and started storing items away in our chests. With the last few spots of storage being filled, tree branches and all, it was time to race home. The next few days here was me spending time on dismantling my raft and building a new one. One in which I didn't use as much, but I do build myself a nice and quick raft for later. Next was the wooden remains that we had left with some buoys laying about as I turned that into what would become my main source of travel. 
I also added these two little side pieces so we don't have to climb up on the raft anymore. I felt that just was so very annoying. So, as you know, I was like, hmm, how can I fix that? I was like, okay, let's do this. And you know what? It works. I love it. I was checking on my food to get a full belly's worth, all the while making sure the chests we brought to the raft were empty and ready to go. Caught me up a few more sardines just before nightfall and left two of them on to cook. With my raft finally equipped with everything needed for a good venture or two, all that was left was some pee pee coconut. By this point in my game, potatoes were a big deal. Just before heading out to another island, I grabbed the food and went on my way. The next island I made my way to gave me quite the scare and a problem. One more. We need one more. One more. One lazy tree. Lazy tree, I found you. <coughs> ah, what the fuck? <coughs> <coughs> You, yeah, uh-huh, no, what do you mean no? You mean yes. So, yeah, there we go. Perfect. We got the arrow going. A few more island hops later led me here. An island I was really hoping to show you all. So, I've been saving this one for almost a rainy, like, day. But this island I've added here, this this place you're, you're going to see up ahead, this place is called The Goonies. And for those who know of the movie The Goonies, good on you. For those who don't, it's an old school movie very old school back in the day and i also know where i am now i i was lost but now i'm not oh my god there's a potato on this holy crap so worth it yo so worth it potatoes potato oh my god the peepees oh that's a shark what type of shark is that actually oh <gasps> yo i totally didn't mean to do that it it pushed i don't like that oh my god oh my god why why game all right, let's do this Goonie style. I gotta keep an eye out for more potatoes though. Apparently there might be a lot of potatoes on this island. Could also be very dangerous island. I don't know yet. <laughs> Goonies. Oh, am I gonna need a pickaxe? Oh, maybe I should bring a pickaxe. With a pickaxe in hand, we were finally able to open up that secret path, leading us into this open array of stuff. It's like a whole other place in here. Holy smokes. Yo, look at this. <laughs> it's a mini life raft. <laughs> okay. It's kind of cute. On oh, a mini boat. What the? Why is. What? Okay. You know what? I'm not going to complain. I like it. <gasps> Food. Oh, look at this place. It's a cute little. Whoa, what? There's a little. What is. Is this. Is this a real thing? <laughs> This is so weird, dude. This is literally so trippy. There's a little crab in there. We got little boars running around. I think. Yeah, right. Wait, I saw it. It was like a little. Oh my god, hold on. This is so weird. I feel like I stepped into like the weirdest place ever. There, there. That's the boar. I see. Oh my god. It was so shocking with the amount of work put into this island and really just had me smiling all the way through. I can say with all that explored, it was time to take my raft and bid this island farewell. Seeing that I need more water for the potatoes, I built myself a few more still collectors, watering everything I could and made sure my raft was once again filled with all the essentials. I think it's only one. So we're going to have to build a couple, I guess. Okay. Your and... Yeah. Four. One, two, three. Oh, we're out of water. We were more than serious about going to as many different islands as we could. That and I still wanted to show you all the four corner islands set around the map. Ooh, do I just go straight for it, I guess? I guess so. I'm gonna go straight for it. Or wait, maybe we could turn a little bit here. Okay, so if one wanted to get up, I guess I would go that way. Or here. Holy smokes, this place is huge though. Goodbye, snakey poo. Okay, hold on. Is that? There's a lot of snakes here. Well, let's hope there's no snakes right here. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, uh, what do we got? Two cloths. Again, like, I don't really need much. It's more so just exploring and seeing what these, like, islands and places offer. If you open these, how screwed would you be? Because <laughs> you open the door and it's just, that's it. 
Hello, upside down <laughs> boat and other boat that's right here. Excuse me. The best part about today is that it was raining outside, which also meant free water for my stills and potatoes. <laughs> yeah, okay. With all that water and potatoes grown from the previous days, we had a lot of fuel coming now. All right, so we have three full jerry cans of fuel. That is more than I ever thought I'd have. That is literally insane. I, I'm, I'm excited to get started. But before we do that, I need to... Just want to double check. All right, potatoes should be fine by the time we come back. I'm trying out the gyrocopter now. I'm, I'm like super curious that's gonna work. So we wanted to go like that way. There's a corner map I wanted to go to. It was the Goonie Island we went to, but there was a map, like a, a corner one we want to go to. <gasps> How do you? Up is space bar. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, we're doing it, guys. Why would I want to stop the engine right now? What? Excuse me? Oh my god. Dude, we're up. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh. I wonder if you could stop the engine, fall, put fuel in it, and then go back up? Unless you need. Uh, maybe you maybe can. Being so very distracted as I normally get, there was this juicy looking island in front of me. A sunken ship and all. Gotta be careful with this. I don't know how this, like. Oh god. Oh, yeah, stop the engine. Okay. Ah! There were a lot of snakes. I just saw them. Oh, there's one. What is this? Woo, got him in the head. And now he big dead. Hold on, what's over here? Oil side. I love this thing, man. Holy crap. <laughs> this thing is awesome. So, from this island, we just gotta make sure we go diagonal black. What happened? Did I hit something? Ooh, wait, can we land on this right here? Um, hold on, maybe we could land over here? No. Cool, okay, that works. Look at this place, though, it's huge! This is the second island. Oh, I don't have the lashing on me. Um... Ooh, this is perfect. This leads us all the way back to where we want to go and then like to everything else as well. It was pretty tough flying the gyrocopter around while it was storming out. With a few more days passing us by, my plan was to get all the fuel I could stored up, plan out my next attack for another boss with more crafted up refined spears. Refined spears did double the damage, but with extra costs to resources. So looking to take our raft out for another boss fight, we did end up getting lost here. Jumping from island to island, looking around the ocean in hopes Hopes for another sign, anything to show us where the next boss may have been. Lucky for me, while scouting about with my binoculars, I did happen to see something out in the distance, sticking right out of the water and that led me to believe this was another boss. I don't see anything else in the distance, which is scaring me. This is the closest I've come to anything in the water, just randomly being there. Oh my god, the great abia abia! Goblin shark? The heck's a goblin shark? <gasps> I think I killed it. Okay, okay, wait. If we killed that, that's... You know, I can't even take it. Hold on. Oh, I don't like this. Okay, so we actually have to go underwater for this one then? Is that a thing? <gasps> what the fudge? Yo, what? <laughs> oh, my God. It pushes you into okay, okay, okay. No one told me bosses could fly. Let me tell you, this this one could. Oh, 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 oh baby! Ah, oh my god! Yo. Okay, every okay, every time you throw it, it you have oh my god. This time I needed to make sure I just dodged and weaved while hitting the boss. The gun wasn't even that strong. Throwing these things are ridiculous. Come on. Come on. Where is it? Where is it? Oh. My spears back. 
Yeah. Yes. <laughs> spears. Those spears really do a lot of damage, though. I mean, mind you, finding that many resources it can be pretty tough. Two bosses down with one more to go. For some weird reason, I went on a fishing spree here. All right, this definitely has to be enough fish. I think we have enough fish now. Now with all the fuel in my hands here, we were ready to start loading up that plane we took in before. We're finally closer to the ship too. Look at this thing. Oh, wait. Yeah, I guess this would be a ship. Or actually, no, this would be a tanker. The other ones have been ships. This is more so a tanker than anything. Repair plane engine, propeller cockpit. Oh, wow. You need to put a lot of food in here. There you go. Okay. Well, we're all out of... Ah, there's no point. Wait, what about- Oh, you just have to put water in it. Okay. Oh, whoa. Holy smoke. Wait, was that a whole serving? That was indeed. Woo, look at that. One of the many things are done. This one's almost done. We're, we're just getting a couple more foods. Got our crop to parts. That's fine. I feel like there's another- Oh, fuel's up here. Hold on. Um, I'm a-coming. I'm a-coming. Fuel. And fuel. Not bad at all, only a few left for food and bills. Did a little more sightseeing as I made my way back home, crafting up more leather and trying to get myself prepared for the end. That sounds really terrible. <laughs> Close to getting more fuel, today was just a simple and quiet day. Taking care of a few things in the morning, potatoes were still on my mind. Today something crazy happened and left me thinking if it was normal or not. Whoa. Whoa, what? Help! Help me! What the f- Are you kidding me? Are there normally planes flying? Have I not noticed that before? Or is that a new thi- What the heck? Hello! Hello over here! No! Oh my god. What the heck? While at this next island, there was a big infestation of crabs. This was something I planned on doing for a while, but didn't know until now what it really was. Today is the day. Today marks the day we kill the last boss. Now, the thing that these bosses all have in common is refined spears just kill it quick, man. That's it. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> I'm going now. And I believe I can see the thing from here. There's something in the water over here. Something I gotta hit? Ding dong. Ding dong, ding dong. Whoa. Whoa, what? Wait, is that the thing? Oh, that was it. What the fudge did that? Oh my god. Yo, it's pulling me. It's pulling me. What the heck? Yo, it pulls you off the, the raft? Woo, baby. I don't like this one. If it can pull me off the raft, man. I gotta swim back to the raft. Oh god. Nope. Oh my god. So this thing hits you, or me at least. I might die. Ah! Fighting this in the water. I'm I'm literally what the fudge, dude! I hold on. Okay, maybe we're not. Kind of not fair. You go through everything, but hey, I'll I'll I'll. Bro, ah, killed it. Gotta get the spears before they go. <laughs> no, I'm not going for that. No way in heck, dude. Oh, so look at my arm, guys. So we're kind of bleeding a lot, you know? That's not fun. That one was a lot tougher, like much tougher. Like, holy crap, was that tougher. Is that a word, tougher? I feel like that should be a word. The toughest thing here was to not bleed out and get back home in time to heal myself. But I was far, far away from home base. Where is it? I saw you over here somewhere. It was. Oh my god, thank you. I, for a second, I was like really doubting myself. Oh my goodness. Um, bandage. Woo, baby, that was close. Fueling up my gyrocopter to a full tank, it was now time to show you all the corner island that I had planned. I made a lot more fuel than I thought. 
And, uh, yeah. It's a lot of fuel. And I'm gonna go places and do things. Let's just take a look. Let's keep an eye on it, just in case you never know. We might have to land this on shore. I don't know. Uh, it's gonna be close. We're going down, man, man, we're going down. Okay, I got it, guys. I got it. Oh. No, I don't got it. I don't got it anymore. All right, I got it again. Come on, come on, baby. Come on, come with me. I'll save you. Go, 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 please. Just go. No, I lost it again. Oh, I'll get it again. Oh, I got it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I lost it again. I'll get it. Ooh, baby, you scared me. Okay, cool. <laughs> that was kind of nice, actually. Fuel that sucker up. You took a couple more days here while flying out to another island that would have many resources and lots to explore. Now, this is something. Look at this island. I'm going to try to keep us as low as I can go, but this is crazy. All right, that works. Cool. Okay. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Wait, do we need SPF? Yeah, I'll take it. Is that all that's down there, though? All right, I'm going for it. There's one. Get rid of some yuccas so I can see ya. What? Why is there axe? What? Okay. <gasps> whoa, whoa! Look at all the stone! Look at all the stone! Is there something in the water? You? Hello? What the fudge was that? Let me in, let me in, let me in. I jumped into the water and decided on making my way back to the gyrocopter. I wasn't done there though, as other parts of the island still needed to be explored. You gotta open up all the doors. You know you have to do that. It's the first thing you do. Open. Open. Oh, hello. Wait, what was over here? Why is there so many tires? Get out of my way. Move. Hello, I've made it to the islands. Just mm, the cat store. This one. <laughs> I don't know what to call it, man. With some of the days still ahead of me, I attempted and tried to make my way back. I can't believe it. Honestly, I, I really can't. I spent so many days trying to find my way back home. I actually got lost. This last part, I was like watching a YouTube video or something in the background. And then I looked back at my game while I was flying in the air quickly. And I was lost. I was lost for a long time. I can't believe, I, I cannot, I literally cannot believe I found my way back home. It's like, finally. With the last day here, day 100, I couldn't believe we made it out alive in this one. A hundred days in Stranded Deep. All right, yeah, yeah, that's it, that's it. You see this now? So creepy. I did not see that on the actual, like, attempt for the boss kill. I did not see it. That I definitely saw. This, I thought was something else at first, and then I was like, nope, it's definitely scary. And then that was just like... Oh man, hentai all the way. That is, whew, that's too much. Things right now were looking up and as excited as I was to see the ending, part of me was a little sad. He survived. Look at that. <laughs> Day 100 of this game survived, man. Oh, it took a long time. Yep. Fixed it. All right. <laughs> this is cool. Yeah. Look at it. It's done. Oh, and then the door, <laughs> we go home. I just want to say though, thank you so much for sticking around. Thank you so much for still being here. Thank you, thank you, thank you for everything you've done for me, seriously. Leaving comments, watching a video, that means the world to me. It really does and I'll never stop saying it. Thank you guys so much for allowing me to be myself when it comes to playing games and just doing what I personally love to do. I really do love it. That's why I keep doing it. And I'll never stop. I'll never stop replying to all the comments and all that sort of stuff. But at the end of the day, I really do appreciate it. I'm so thankful and grateful to be in the position I am. And I love you guys so much. So just thank you. And it's time to go home. So let's go home. Let's do it. Uh, are you sure you want to leave? Yes. Safe. All right. Let's see what's happening. Hello? Whoa. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> Ducky! Ducky's with us, guys. Don't worry. Ducky's here to... Okay, this is good. Hello, Ducky. Oh, you should have pat the Ducky on the head. 
did you did you close the wait pat ducky what about can we cl should we i feel like we should close that first but okay Whoop. pat ducky pat the ducky on the head pretty please pretty pretty please close the cockpit oh here we go cool okay <sighs> Um, beep, boop, 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 dee, doot, whoosh, and engage rail. I think this is where it turns us. Oh, here we go. All righty. Oh, baby. Uh, that doesn't look that clear. Are we can get enough speed. Oh, no time like the present. Let's try it out. Throttle engaged. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. It was good knowing you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh crap, oh crap. Oh! oh. Are we okay? Uh, oh, do we actually. Please! <laughs> Please let me leave! Do I get to see my island once more? Maybe? No? I mean, it'd be cool, but I guess not. That's so oh, wait, was that my island? No, that was the Meg. Goodbye, Meg! Little ducky. We did it! <laughs> oh my god, we freaking did it! Yes! Oh my god. Oh. Crashes, dies, impaled. Ducky's still good, though. Uh-oh. Three hours later. You know what? This would be the perfect transition into the forest. Oh my god, this would be so cool. Uh oh. We doing all right? Is this supposed to happen? What's happening? What's going on? Is there a part two? Uh oh, I can't move my mouse anymore. <gasps> Wade. What? What? Oh. I was like, at first, I was like, okay, it's definitely the forest. But then I was like, wait, that doesn't look familiar. But it does look familiar. And it looks recent. I was like, wait, that's stranded deep. Is this a time loop game of some sort? 